Good morning guys. It is Arika Misha and it is Sunday morning and this morning on the menu we are cooking breakfast in a skillet. Uh, today I'm going to be doing for breakfast I'm going to be doing like a um, I don't know breakfast in the skillet that's what I'm calling it and as you see what I have here things that you would normally eat for breakfast. I have just something I made up guys um, tater patties I have these tater patties I got from Publix. How many is in here? Two, four, six, eight, ten. Yeah, let me see. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. It's ten. Ten hash brown patties. That's all they are. Hash browns. They call them tater patties. They're hash browns to me. Whatever. All right. And we have the country style fresh pork sausage from Publix. And we have the Oscar Mayer fully cooked thick cut bacon and of course we have my favorite public grade A jumbo eggs all right and as far as our seasons I have the grind black pepper I have the star of the show my parsley mm-hmm y'all know parsley parsley and I have some salt and I have the Oybe garlic herb and I have the Oybe blackened. And I have the seasons to season my, um, the, uh, to season the uh, sausage. So these are basically things that you would have for breakfast. So you guys will see. Um, I'm going to go ahead and incorporate all of them into the skillet. And I'm going to, you know, of course, put it in the oven, uh, bake it for maybe about 20 minutes. 15 20 minutes um, and you guys will see yeah I call it breakfast in the skillet and also so that you guys know for dinner I am going to be doing in the skillet as well I just want to keep to that whole bacon in a skillet thing um, in our skillet also I'm going to be making meatball lasagna so of course I'm gonna record that so make sure you guys go and check that video out too I'm sure it'll probably be up around the same time as this video so all right guys let's get into our breakfast skillet all right and what I'm gonna do now guys I'm gonna go ahead and get those hash browns in the air fryer um, and I'll go ahead and get that the bacon it's already cooked so um, I'll probably throw that in the air fryer for a minute or two also um, the eggs, you'll see what we have to do with the eggs. And um, I'll come back, of course, and show you guys me seasoning and cooking the sausage. So, all right, guys, just wanted to show you everything you need for your uh, breakfast skillet. And um, I'll be back so we can get started. All right, guys, I'll be back. Okay, guys, I am back getting ready to get the um, sausage cooked. So basically, um, I'm going to get the, the sausage cooked, um, get the eggs prepped. I've already got our uh, hash browns in the air fryer. Uh, I've got to throw the bacon in the air fryer. We all know that's only going to take like two minutes because it's already cooked. We're just heat warming it up. Um, and then we'll build it. So I'll show you guys how I'm going to do that. So as of right now, we are getting ready. Getting ready to get this sausage cooked up. Let me get my seasons in. Just throwing a little salt. Uh, the oybe herb. And like I said, guys, oybe isn't just for seafood. You can use use oybe to season all your meat. Oybe is a season. It's just a regular season. You can use it for whatever you want. And I use it on all my meats, not just seafood. So, a little black and pepper here. And, of course, y'all know my parsley got to go in there. So, and I just want to let that sausage get a little brown. You know, get a little brown to it. And I sprayed the pan with a little oil. Y'all know my old faithful canola oil. Over here to our egg mix. 
So you guys can see how that's going to go. All right, let me get you guys adjusted here. All right, there you go. <coughs> so you guys can see how I'm going to do that egg mix. Mm, mm, mm. Sausage tastes delicious. <coughs> so good. All right. So, sausage is nice and done. Okay. Now, let's get over here to our egg mix. So, I am going to do the entire dozen of 12 eggs I'm gonna do the entire dozen of 12 eggs and these are the Publix jumbo grade A eggs I'm gonna do the whole dozen so the girls are up back there don't know what they're doing girl kid stuff I guess but um, if you guys didn't see my girls did start their own YouTube channel they started their YouTube channel Saturday January the 16th not sure when you guys are gonna see this video but I just want to let you guys know that my girls they did start uh, their own YouTube channel and their channel is called AJ um, as in Amaya and Janiyah their name AJ apostrophe S AJ's crib yep that is the girls channel I'm so happy I'm so proud of them we've been working on it for a while so we finally launched it Saturday January the 16th so if you guys have kids you know make sure they go check it out and subscribe to the girls my girls are hilarious they are so funny they are so funny and once again that's AJ's crib all right guys so I've got all my eggs all 12 and I'm gonna do I've got one cup of milk here but I'm just gonna pour in half of it I'm just gonna pour in half of it and see how that goes because I don't want these eggs too watery and the only reason why I'm adding milk is to um, help our eggs fluff helps fluff your eggs makes your eggs nice and fluffy so I've got that half a cup of milk in there with those 12 eggs gonna see how it looks and I might add the other half a cup of milk I just want to see how it looks first before I do that make sure you guys can see what I'm doing yep you can see real good all right looks good looks good doesn't look too watery I'm gonna go ahead and add that other cup so I just wanted to make sure it wasn't too watery so we've got the 12 eggs and we've got a full cup of milk sounds like a lot but it's not you guys saw that just one cup of milk it's really not a lot it's to help our eggs fluff you're here now all right so my skillet I am gonna spray my skillet dealing with eggs so I'm spraying my skillet so that nothing sticks all right, so first thing we're going to do, we're going to lay down our hash browns. Lay them however you want to lay them. This is just how I lay them. Get that whole bottom covered to do it. But make sure you put the eggs last. I'll show you guys. All right, so we've got our hash browns. We're going to put a layer of cheese in here. Layer of cheese, guys. Y'all see? Layer of cheese. See how I got that? Layer of cheese. We're just going to just gonna build it. Layers and layers. You guys will see. All right? We're going to sprinkle some sausage. Some sausage around. Sprinkle some of that delicious sausage. All right, let's get some bacon. It's like we're making a little, a little omelet in the skillet. That's, that's basically all. Eggs. The eggs is the star of the show, guys. Our eggs. Okay. So 
Let's go ahead. We're going to get our eggs poured in. Pour your eggs all around, guys. Slowly pour it all around. There you go. Got our eggs. Huh? See that, guys? See that? See how it makes it? Okay. And then you know what? We'll add the rest of our toppings. Let's go ahead and do the rest of this cheese. Gonna do the rest of that cheese. Uh, the egg's gonna go all the way down to the bottom, guys. The eggs are gonna go all the way down to the bottom. They're gonna go all the way down to the bottom, so. Put our bacon all around. It's just like a, a big omelet, a big giant omelet. Make sure we get all my bacon now. I'm gonna be trying to steal my bacon. Then look, guys, we're just gonna put that sausage. Ooh, wait. Put that sausage there. Look at that. Look at that. Okay, get all my sausage. See, and I just kind of like put a little bit in the middle there, you know. Give it a nice little hump in the middle. So, I'm get my hands washed real quick, guys. Y'all know me. I gotta wash, wash, wash my hands. Wash, wash, wash. And I've already got my oven preheated. I've got my oven preheated to 425, guys. 425. And you know the other star of the show? My parsley flakes. Yes, your girl puts parsley on everything. Just gonna shake that on there, get that all pretty. Y'all know parsley makes it pretty. Makes me feel like we're eating a bunch of greens. But y'all know we don't really eat much greens, but it's okay. We still happy, healthy people. Okay, get that parsley in there. When those eggs get cooked, it's gonna be beautiful. All right, okay girl, okay girl, enough with the parsley, okay. All right, and I'm gonna go ahead and zoom y'all in so y'all can see how it looks before we cook it. Look at that guys, taking y'all in. Beautiful, it's like a big giant omelet, look at it. Big giant omelet. Beautiful. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and pop it in the oven, and you guys will see what it looks like. I'll be back. Okay, guys, I am back, and I just took our breakfast skillet out of the oven. Once again, I had it on 425 for 30 minutes. 425 for 30 minutes. And look at it, guys. Oh, my goodness. Y'all can't tell me that don't look good. That breakfast skillet looks so good. And see, spraying the pan, spraying it, see how it helps it rise and also helps keeps it from sticking to your, your, your uh, pan, your, your skillet. It's going to be a nice omelet. You could just take it right on out. Y'all know I'm going to zoom in because that's what I do for y'all. That's what I do. I zoom in for y'all. I do it just so y'all can be drooling and wishing y'all could have some. No, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. That's not why I do it. I'm just kidding, y'all. Yeah, I do kind of, you know, want to tease y'all a little bit. But yeah, this is our breakfast skillet, y'all saw. It's just a big old giant omelet. That's all it is. But you know what? You just cut it, you know, however you want to cut it. But look at that, guys. Y'all can't tell me that don't look good. Y'all saw what we put in it? Bacon, egg, cheese. Ooh, wait, look at the parsley. Look at the parsley. Look at the parsley. Ooh, wait. Okay, guys, that is it. That is our breakfast skillet cooked by your girl, you know, Arika Misha. Thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to follow me on all my social media, Instagram. And don't forget, guys, y'all know what I'm finna say. Knowledge is power. Thanks, guys. Bye.